So I mentioned it was raining and then it kind of stopped. That's what you were saying earlier. Yes. Little water spouts here and there. We're going to see. Yeah, there is a risk of water spouts and a risk of tornadoes uh, with the outer bands of these these tropical storms, especially. But you can see Padre Island is getting a break. More is going to be on the way though, so you have a break now. If you need to run outside real quick on the island, this might be the time to do so. We are seeing the winds uh, across the region, so we've got 23 mile per hour gusts in Corpus Christi, 34 mile per hour gusts offshore at that buoy. So that's the strongest wind we're seeing right now with the center of that storm just south of um, our main buoy that is about 70 nautical miles offshore. Also, Something that we are seeing 70 nautical miles offshore are eight foot waves showing up now at our buoy as Tropical Storm Harold is approaching the South Texas coast, likely going to make landfall closer to the valley than Corpus Christi. But we are still going to see some of the biggest impacts along our coastal region, along our beaches, along our bays, because we've got some strong easterly winds that will be headed right across Corpus Christi Bay that could cause some flooding across areas that are facing to the west as well as through Baffin Bay, a similar story. But you can see eight foot waves now showing up. The yellow and orange is going to be eight to 12 foot waves, possibly even a few higher swells out there. So I am expecting 10 foot waves at our beaches by six through six and 8 a.m. Waves may lower just a bit through noon, but I am expecting them to stay on the higher side throughout the day today. These are higher waves than we're used to at the Texas coast. We're going to have stronger rip currents than we're used to, so I do not advise getting in the water because it will be dangerous. And additionally, these waves are going to be pushing water on shore. Tides are already running high. We're talking one to three foot storm surge possible, inundation possible. So the beaches are going to see water covering them, if not already throughout the morning. Barb.